New outrage tonight over an ongoing controversy at Michigan State University. Students, faculty and donors are now calling for the release of a new report about why the well liked head of the business school was ousted earlier this year. The school board brought in an outside law firm to investigate the resignation of Sanjay Gupta. Grant Herms live tonight for us and Grant they're calling for transparency here. Well, they are because the board actually got a look at that report from that outside investigation yesterday, but reportedly told lawyers not to present in writing, meaning there'd be no paper trail or documents for reporters or concerned Spartans to ask for. And today, those concerns from those Spartans were made loud and clear. Honesty, accountability, and leadership to do what's right. Three Christmas wishes for all of you from me. Calls for transparency and answers about the ousting of former MSU School of Business Dean Sanjay Gupta. Any cover up of all the facts by the board will only result in the continuation of unethical behavior by those in charge and greater harm to this university. How can you as board members pretend nothing is wrong? Why is it you don't strive for transparency and doing the right thing? Gupta was forced to resign in August after he failed to report a Title IX violation stemming from an inappropriate behavior by two other staff members during a faculty party last spring. Gupta had also expressed desires to become university president before leaving, and faculty members called his resignation mysterious, prompting an outside investigation. During their meeting Friday, the board did not address what was in that report and has made it impossible to access the records through public records. Still, interim president Teresa Woodruff praised the university's work on Title IX protections. I am committed to building trust with our university communities around RVSM prevention work. And I want to thank MSU's people for continuing the important work of building a culture of support. Now that alumni you heard from at the very beginning there who was asking for transparency, she also told trustees that she plans to boycott donating to the School of Business and warned the board that these trustees or rather these uh, alumni may also follow in her footsteps to say how serious they are about being able to see this report. Back to you. Yeah, and Grant, there's another report uh, that's expected about sexual misconduct on campus. Uh, can that can we expect that to be released soon? We can expect that to be released soon. Today, the interim president said that campus-wide survey, which was about sexual misconduct, harassment, Title IX, and how the university handles all mm -hmm. of those, should be released sometime next month. So we'll be waiting for that as well. Yeah. Back to you. We will be. All right, Grant, we appreciate it.